What's up guys and welcome to another episode of the Hybrid Squad Builder series. So um, apologies for not uploading yesterday, I've just been kind of making the most of summer and the most of you know going out and stuff like that. So um, I did actually go paintballing and I think, yeah, I went to some like festival during the day which is pretty epic. It was like a, a something that was happening in my hometown um, and uh, yeah, it was really fun. It was like an amazing way to close off. Uh, summer because I do actually go back to college on Monday, which is kind of annoying, but you know, I have had probably the best well, and it has been uh, the best summer I've ever had. So, uh, you know, just everything went well, YouTube went well. Uh, I just did a lot of stuff that I didn't think I'd get back into. You know, I've started playing football a lot more, um, and it's just been fantastic. You know, I really, really enjoyed summer, and I hope you guys have uh, enjoyed it as well. And I wish you guys all the ba best. Uh, for going back to school or college or whatever you're doing uh, because I know that isn't really th the funnest thing to do in the world when you probably would want to spend a bit more time uh, in summer but you know sadly that's not going to happen and we do actually have to sit down and be educated <laughs> but um, yeah let's get on to the video now as you can see here we're going to be using a 3 4 one, two formation and our goalkeeper is going to be Romando great little player um, he's got 74 diving 71 handling 71 kicking and also 74 reflexes one of them players which you don't really expect too much of but then when you play with him he's just fantastic you know really spectacular keeper um, can really you know hold a save and his reflexes are super good as well uh, in game so let's check out the first centre back now as you can see here we have got Walter Samuel the Inter Milan centre back uh, from Argentina he's got 65 pace 87 defending and 83 heading really really good player he's 6 foot tall as well and only cost me 2 4k so that is a real bargain there uh, the second centre back now as you can see here is going to be company he's got 73 pace 71 dribbling 72 passing 85 defending and 77 heading um, a great player you know everyone's used him if you if you've had the coins well he's pretty cheap now you know you can tell he's 4.5k uh, and also six foot four so we can obviously head them balls in and obviously defend pretty well uh, let's check out the third and final centre back now and see here we have got win um, amazing player you know if, I think a lot of people that have had the coins to buy this player will have used this player put it that way uh, but he has just got amazing stats you know 96 pace for a centre back that is amazing and he's only 66 rated so uh, he's got 68 defending and also 73 heading so it's pretty good in that department as well uh, but let's check out the left mid now as you can see here you're probably all thinking I've got Hazard but I haven't I've got El Gahanasi um, El Garnasi, I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, but he's got four star skills and four star weak foot, I think. Um, or it might even be four star, no, five star weak foot. I really don't know, but you know, either way, he's very, very good. He's got 86 pace and 81 dribbling. There are his standout stats. Uh, got a lot of pace, like I said, and you know, his dribbling is fantastic too. Um, let's check out the right mid now. As you can see here, we have got the in form Gomez from this team of the week. Uh, great little player. I really do think I should have played him in more of an attacking role because right mid doesn't really suit him that well. So if you do want to buy this player, I would recommend playing him in like a 4 3 3 or 4 3 2 1 to get the best out of him. But uh, he's got 85 pace, 78 shooting, 75 passing, and also 87 dribbling. Amazing player there and really worth the coins I paid for him. Uh, only cost me 19,750 coins. And he's 5 foot 5, so he's quite small and agile. Uh, Let's check out the first centre mid now, as you can see here. We have got Stuart Holden, great player, uh, plays for Bolton. Uh, no, not Bolton, yes it is Bolton. Yeah, it's Bolton. <laughs> um, but he's got 75 pace, 72 shooting, 80 passing and also 78 dribbling. Uh, really, really good well, stats there actually for a, a 78 red centre mid and just really can hold uh, the midfield by himself. But he does, it, well, is actually partnered by uh, this guy. He's Bradley, I think his name is, yeah. Plays for Cassiano, or I think that's what is Is it Cass? No, Chivo Verena. Um, and, like, these two players, like, I, I don't know how to explain it. They're just, like, it's not the perfect centre mids, but, like, they can hold their own in midfield, you know. They don't really need any backup from the centre backs or, like, anyone to push up uh, or come back from the strikers. So, um, and this guy actually here has a lethal shot. He's got, like, 80 shot power or something. And just look at them stats, you know. 71 shooting, 70 passing, 70 dribbling, also 74 defending and heading. So he's more of the defensive role of the centre mids and then Stuart Holden is more the attacking guy. Uh, but let's move on to the centre forward now. As you can see here, we have got a blue card. It's, his name's Pontius. Uh, he's got 85 shooting from a 74 rated card. That is outstanding. Uh, he's got 78 pace, 70 passing and also 77 dribbling. Uh, reminds me of like a Dost character. He's really, really good on the ball um, and just quite tall and stuff. So he can sort of hold his own up there. Uh, and obviously the shooting is very good as well. But he cost me as in Z here 30,000 coins, which is pretty cheap for a 74 rated card especially with them stats anyway um but let's check out the striker now as you can see here we have got the inform Henri. 
great player, um, fantastic. Should have got the blue version because you know he is a lot better than this version. But sadly, I didn't have the coins to spare um, and had to sort of settle with the first in form. But he's got 84 pace, 86 shooting, 70 passing, and also 87 dribbling. Really, really good stats there. And I don't know why he hasn't got better heading. Uh, I think he definitely should have better heading. But four star skills and four star weak foot from what I know uh, and he's got 27 well he actually cost me 27k uh, he's 6 foot 2 as well and you you know you can just look at that goal to game ratio and um, that's fantastic and really speaks for itself so the final player in our team is going to be the inform Montero well actually the second inform Montero fantastic little player I uh, did actually do a video on him called Information uh, if you want to go check that out I'll put a link in the description or at the end of the video uh, and you guys can go check that out if you want a more in-depth review on this player so he cost me as you can see here uh, 68,500 coins which is pretty pretty expensive but he has scored an eight goals in nine games for me which really does make up for it so um yeah that's going to be the end of the video if you have enjoyed it so far then please feel free to drop a like it really really does help me out and if we could hit like 500 likes that would be amazing um i know people have been saying you know you shouldn't ask for likes but <clears throat> whenever i don't um if like i don't know people say oh if you don't ask for likes then we'll forget so um, you know, just don't think of this as me trying to press you into liking it. Just think of it as like a friendly uh, reminder of, you know, what you guys can do. You know, you can rate the video um, up to your own accord. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. Hit the like button if you have enjoyed the video. 500 likes would be amazing. And peace.